Hi YouTubers, I'm glad you're all here. Thank you very much for joining me. Here's an update what's going on there at Mammoth Lakes Long Valley Caldera. USGS is only reporting four earthquakes today. It looks like the largest being a magnitude 1.4. We got a 0 0.1. Real shallow. That was by the airport. Only 0 0.7 uh, miles above or below, excuse me, below sea level. A 0 0.2 down by Tom's plate place. A 1.2. Four, um, 2.2 miles in depth and a 0 0.5, 2.4 miles below sea level. This drawn out in purple is the Mammoth Lakes Resurgent Dome. The, the caldera itself is actually about 20 miles long by 11 miles wide. And I got the... Uh, area drawn out in yellow for the caldera. Let me bring this up a little bit. And then the purple was the resurgent dome itself. The uh, 0 0.1, let's zoom into that, that was by the airport. Right there, a little concerning. This one here is in fact marked in red right there. They are not reporting it. Um, it was at 1346 Universal Time. That would have been at 646 AM. We'll go to the spectrogram so you can see it. Not being reported. All right, and then we got another one I want to cover, which is marked in red up over here. Um, at 529 Universal Time. Once again, going to Google Earth, here's the location of that 1.4, but it wasn't a 1.4. Okay, it's long uh, Convict Creek Fault Zone, and it was a magnitude 1.73. And we'll go to its seismic signature. All right, and let's make that bigger so we can see what's going on. Yeah, you can see here. What would be classified? Well, we got some harmonic tremors right there. Um, but the fault moved. Yeah, this would often call as tectonic, but the fault moved. So here is Convict Creek Fault. And up over here is the Long Valley Caldera Mammoth Lakes. The next earthquake marked in red at 2355. That would have been at 6.55 p.m. yesterday, last night. And that comes in as a magnitude 1.13. Very small. We'll go back to its seismic signature. They are not reporting that earthquake. I don't know why when they had other ones that they did report that were smaller. Two more marked in red. Let's take a look at its seismic signature. Oh, tectonic fault movement. And there's another one. Let's bring this up so you can see it. Right, okay, through there. And we'll pull it over. Right there. Yeah, that's another small one. And then we got another small one here. Let's bring that up. And we got another small one at 2053. I almost didn't see that because these two blend into each other right there. That one too is not being reported. There's the spectrogram. That one would have been at 153 p.m. again also yesterday. And it comes in as a magnitude 1.68. Yeah, I'm just shaking my head about all these earthquakes that they are not reporting. Let's take a look at the seismic signature that was going on here. Yeah, fault movement. And we'll bring it down, take a look at some other stuff. Example right there. Oh, that's harmonic. That is most definitely harmonic. Magma coming in, rising up in the system. Let's see if I can make that bigger so you can see it. And let's go down to see what it was showing when I pulled all the files. Look at all this activity. 
Now this is the monitor. Let me show you right there in the town of Mammoth Lakes. And I believe it is in the police station where the monitor is at. It's currently um, 3.13 p.m. their time. And let's take a look. Yeah, more movement. We'll take a look at the spectrogram so you can see the depth of the hot pockets of melt. And let's go over here a little bit farther. We got hot gases and heated water. And this is what it was showing when I pulled the files. Looks like we got a quake right there. Yeah. Three small quakes there. And yeah, let's just, we'll just jump around here. Like I said, someone was asking, yeah, what's going on? Well, the earthquakes are still going on. This is currently what it's showing. And they actually call this blobs of magma that's coming into the system, rising up. Yeah, magma naturally wants to rise. And yeah, let me pull it over so you can see the... Now, this is all universal time. You see here, this is at the town of Mammoth. And we'll pull it back another four hours, and we got other small earthquakes. You can see, see them there. Yeah, what's happening is the magma's coming up. It found a conduit, um, either a, um, a dike intrusion or um, like a like a tunnel, a hose, and it comes up. It reaches a blockage and it stops and it melts it a little bit more, and then yeah, there's another one right there. I did that one. That's uh, 1346 or whatever, and. There's the other one, um, 12, 17 maybe. I'm just guessing by looking at it here because we got the time down there and up there. And another little one there and we'll bring it back and yeah, nothing through this four hours. And then we got one there at five, I think that was 528. That's the other one that I did. But the earthquakes are still happening there. The volcano is still recharging. If you have any thoughts or questions, um, yeah, put those down below. And if you're prepping, keep prepping. And if you're not prepping, start your prepping. It's a good way to beat inflation. You don't know if we're going to have floods or tornadoes or earthquakes or volcanic eruptions, war. Um, yeah, you just don't know. And prepping is a great way to uh, survive and beat whatever is coming so thank you for watching thank you for subscribing please stay safe and i'll talk to you later god bless you